Welcome to another video uh, from PyPad Mathematics. I am Professor Lamb, and we are going to uh, I'm going to use an app called Number Pieces to work a little bit on um, using this concrete model uh, to work with hundreds, tens, ones, represent a given whole number up to uh, like 999 in, in various ways. So uh, we have uh, base 10 blocks where we have three specific uh, blocks that help represent or model the numbers that we are talking about or that we are uh, trying to learn at an early age and we make this smallest unit uh, we call it a unit uh, some people call it the ones or uh, but we can later on redefine what the ones are therefore redefining what the values are for these blocks so we start off and we're dealing with whole numbers then we want our smallest block here of the base 10 blocks to to equal a value of one and when we have that then what we can see is that we can stack 10 of these ones on top of each other I kinda got off a little bit there and when we stack 10 on top we actually notice that it is the same length as one of our longs so it is in proportion it is proportionate to 10 of these uh, ones and this option or this app allows you to break that 10 apart into the 10 ones or lump it together so uh, you have this option we model these numbers and uh, I'm gonna take a few of these away um, uh, where we're going to trash that, we're going to circle all those, I want to trash them and let's say I want to model the number 437 well I have 437 meaning I have seven ones I have three tens and four hundreds so taking that out one two three four five six seven I take all of those and I move them over here if you notice that you can't select them all and just drag them over so I have seven ones there and then I have three longs or three tens and then I have four hundreds one two three four so we have our four hundreds one two one two, three, and fours at the bottom are three tens and then our seven ones. And so this helps us model the number 437. Well, I'm going to circle them all up. I'm going to trash them and uh, I'm going to erase, erase it all, yes. And we do another number, let's say 563. Uh, then we can go with our, we have one, two, three, four, five hundred, and six tens, two, three, four, five, six, and then three ones, one, two, three. And so with early childhood uh, learning and building this understanding and modeling the hundreds, tens, and ones with the base ten block, uh, allow students to see that uh, this these are your ones these are your units they have a value of one each and when we have three of them it has a value of three these are our longs each long equals ten so when you have six longs that equals sixty and then the five or the five ten I mean hundreds these are your flats and each one equals 100 so when you have five of them all together that total is 500 and one thing that you want to do when you're building this early understanding this modeling is to show them that when I have 563 that's 500 plus 60 plus 3 so we write it out in expanded form 563 so now the 500 correlates directly to our five um, flats and our 60 correlates directly to our six longs and then our three units correlates directly to our three 
uh, uh, or three ones correlates directly to our three units. This helps connect the abstract, which is our number 563, to the concrete, which is our base 10 blocks. And this app allows you to help model that using the technology. And of course, if they have the base 10 blocks in front of them, uh, the handheld ones, then they can follow along and model along with you. Or if they have the technology on another mobile device, then they can manipulate them electronically as you are manipulating. Um, so these are important things to do as an early childhood teacher to where you're going to help them build this concrete understanding of what our number system is, what our place value system is. And base 10 blocks are one way to do it. And this app, Number Pieces app, is a good app to, um, to help model that, to help show it. So um, again, uh, this is PyPad Mathematics, and I am Professor Lamb.